You mentioned the recent uh, work conference, the Foreign Affairs Work Conference, um, where I understand one of the issues discussed was how to make sure there's a correct understanding of China as a trustworthy, lovable, and respectable country. Now, at the same time, President Xi was calling diplomatic relations a struggle. He asked his diplomats to engage in a fighting spirit, and he called for a diplomatic iron army. Are we likely to see a return to wolf warrior diplomacy, and how is that lovable? <laughs> <laughs> when we talk about the kind of iron uh, diplomatic army, he really means that the, uh, the, the diplomats, uh, Chinese diplomats, both at home and around the world, should stay disciplined and well, uh, uh, you know, disciplined and uh, in terms of uh, uh, making sure that they have very strong moral integration and, and work hard. So it's not really something about a kind of uh, wolf warrior, quote unquote. So I, I, I don't, so I think that the fundamental uh, goal of China's diplomats would be to contribute uh, their um, uh, efforts in making sure that China's uh, relations with other countries be warm and cooperative. And then by that we mean that we try to create a favorable uh, international environment for China's modernization drive.